Good morning, my three-year-olds. How are you? I am popping onto this video to show you guys how to use some Play-Doh and making shapes with the letters that we're doing this week. So this week, as you might have heard, we are working on W and X, okay? I have these letters right back here. So we're working on W, that's a big W, a capital W, and this is a little W. There's an uppercase, which is the big one, and a lowercase. And then we have X. We have an uppercase X, a big X, and a lowercase X, a little X. So we're gonna work on rolling out with Play-Doh those two letters. And those of you that have been in my class and probably some of the other classes, you guys have done this before. But we're gonna do it a little differently than maybe you're used to seeing. I just wrote a W on one side and an X on another. So I'm gonna take my Play-Doh, if you have Play-Doh at home, you can even use, honestly, if you don't have the Play-Doh at home, you can use anything to, you can use pasta noodles, you can use Q-tips, you can use crayons, whatever you wanna to use to make the shape is totally fine. So I'm gonna take my Play-Doh and let's go ahead and see how many lines this W has. There's one, two, three, four lines for the W. So I'm gonna go ahead and take four little pieces of clay and we'll see what we come up with. So you're gonna take one and you're gonna make that little ball and you're gonna roll that Play-Doh out for the first part of that W. And then I'm gonna stick it on my W that I made. And I'm gonna go ahead and start with the second. I'll do this one. Now remember to kind of push gently so it can roll out. You're just gonna use a little bit of pressure to roll out that Play-Doh. There we go. See, there's the second one. And I'm gonna do the third. Too big. And I'm pushing it down a little bit on my paper so it stays. There you go, one more to make that W. So roll that out, stick it on, check out my W. That's the first letter W and it makes that wuh, wuh, wuh sound. Maybe you can look through some books or um, some pictures. You can think of all the things that start with W, like mm, walrus. Walrus starts with a W. Let's see, walnut starts with a W. Maybe you guys have some books that you can kind of look through and find those W words or when you're on a walk. Maybe you can find some W words. I'm gonna go ahead and make my X a little darker. So mom and dad, if you could write an X on a piece of paper and then kiddos take your Play-Doh. Now we have two lines, right? One, two. So now we have two lines. So we need two pieces of Play-Doh. Get it in that little ball, roll it out. And again, you can use anything. You don't have to use Play-Doh, just use your imagination and try to figure out different ways you can make these letters if you don't have the Play-Doh. And take it and put it on top of one line for the X. And then here's the second one. You can do this with all of your letters if you want to review some of your letters, even your numbers or your name. There is your X. There it is, your second letter, which is an X. Now for X, there's it, it's a hard letter to find some words like X-ray and xylophone. 
But what you could do is when you're on a drive or on a walk or a bike ride, you could look at different signs and you might see um, an X in a word. Um, you can also, while you're reading with mom and dad, maybe just point out the letter X while you're reading. All different kinds of ways we can explore our letters and refresh our memories and um, learn all about our letters. So thanks for joining me guys. And I hope everybody's having a fabulous week and enjoying some family time. Miss you.